Welcome back to another review video, everybody. Today we're going to be reviewing Resolve Older Days featuring 1056 and Paleface Swiss. Um, I'm going to just go ahead and clarify, uh, say this now. I listen to this song probably every day. I've done that for almost five months. I was, well, ever since this song came out. Um, sorry, I, I won't say ever since it came out. Uh, somebody posted like a clip of it in one of their videos, and I was like, I need to hear this. Excuse me. I need to hear this video, so... Um, this is probably one of my favorite songs, like, like, literally I've listened to this eight hours straight before, because I listen to it, listen to music when I'm working, so, um, yeah, let's go ahead and get into the video. That's some, that's something that kind of draw, uh, drew me to the video in the first place. Um, so all three of these guys, I want to say, are leaders of like a, well, what's it leaders, but main the singers or whatever of a, like a screamo quote unquote band. Um, and that's what kind of drew me to it was just like the they're them doing like a kind of like a chord, but while they're doing that screamy thing, or the, the fry vocals, I think is what it's called. Um, that's that was really cool to me when I first heard it, but, um, but yeah. When, once I listened to the song, man, it is awesome. So, like that right there. Should I listen to their albums? Uh, 1056 and Paleface Swiss, should I listen to their albums? Comment down below. Like, you wouldn't think that this would sound good, but, like, the beats or whatever that they have underneath it, and then just them three singing, sounds amazing. Like, you wouldn't, like, um, anybody who would listens to music like this, I mean, obviously, I listen to, like, Slaughter Trooper Veil, and whatever you've seen on my reaction channel, I listen to it. Um, but, I'm like, you would originally think that this wouldn't sound good, but it's it's crazy how, like, it, good it sounds. Like, it's, like, so in sync. Um, obviously, there's probably a lot of editing involved in this, but I mean, it's just an amazing song. And uh, Resolve, I do believe, has this song, just like him singing by himself. Like this was like a, I want to say it was like after the fact that he got these two guys on here. Um, so I'm probably going to end up listening to the album because I have not heard that album yet. But um, but yeah, man, they make this is a good song. That chorus, man, that's, that's probably one of my favorite choruses that I've heard this year. Um, just because... Time out. Really good chorus. It's one of my favorites.
Here it comes, here it comes. Bro, dude! Oh my gosh, every time I hear that I get goosebumps. Like, that is insane. My favorite, that's another one of my favorite parts, dude. Just that that hit that he does, just insane. I gotta say too, like this is a really unique way of like recording a video. Uh, I haven't really seen a lot of people do this type of thing. Um, I guess it adds like that dramatic effect. Well, it adds like a dramatic effect to the song, um, which is really cool. Woo! That was all three of them that time. Okay, this one's a little bit different for than the actual studio version just cause, like there's certain like differences in it uh for example one that uh i think resolve whenever he's it's one of these guys whenever they just sang right there they were doing it lower than the actual thing on the actual studio album um so just little differences in here and there but it's really cool take me back to all the days because i'm afraid i'll never be the same here's my love letter Yeah, man. Awesome video. Um, definitely going to listen to these guys' music. Um, yeah, man. Awesome song. Um, like I said, that's definitely one of my favorite songs that I've heard this year. Um, yeah. At the time I'm recording this, it is... Sorry, I'm about to sneeze. May 24th. So, um, yeah awesome song bro hope you guys enjoyed that review video i will catch y'all in the next one goodbye